Did I ask for your damn opinion? Remember who funds this damn nuthouse. Very well. He's awake. Ah, Mr. Walters. Our friends in the Boston PD hold you up as quite the hero. Before you went all screwy, that is. I don't like heroes, Mr. Walters. And I don't care for your opinions, whoever the hell you are. J. Edgar Hoover, from the Bureau. And considering your position, Mr. Walters, you best mind your manners. Now, what was your business in Innsmouth? Just stopping in on some broad. I was feeling down on my luck. Needed the company. Ah, bullshit. There are only two types of folks that visit Innsmouth. Criminals and fools. And you don't seem like a fool. Appearances can be deceptive. I see. Dr. Hardstrom, if you'd be so kind. Wake him up. Another shot. It's dangerous to put someone shot on the airport. Just charge me with something, because I don't know nothing. This is not going to stop, Mr. Walters, so you may as well level with me. I already told you. It was nothing. A missing person case. And I needed the dough. I was only checked in for one night, and I had to blow the joint in the early hours. Seems the locals didn't take kindly to my snooping. For Christ's sake, Walters! Is it normal in your line of work to break a punk out of the can, then breeze out of town in a stolen car? Only on the good days. But not normally, no. I've had a shitty night, Hoover, so I'd really appreciate you cutting me some slack. What's the Bureau's beef with Innsmouth, anyway? Widespread criminal activity, Mr. Walters. And half the damn town's involved. Our government's never had to handle something on this scale before. But they won't sanction a full-scale operation without more evidence. Well, I appreciate the bedtime story. I don't see where I come into this. Thanks to your meddling, Mackie's gone missing. And he was close to something. Something we could use. Missing? What do you mean, missing? He was supposed to check in hours ago. Our plans have now changed. You'll be accompanying us back into Innsmouth, Mr. Walters, on a small-scale raid. Our target? The Marsh Refinery. <clears throat> I'm not your lapdog, Hoover. I don't work for the Bureau. I'm not in the business of making requests, Mr. Walters. Or have you forgotten your past so quickly? A signature here, a signature there, and we can make you a permanent fixture of this delightful establishment. I could even arrange for you to have your old room back. Fuck you. Good night, Mr. Walters. 
pleasant dreams. You can pause in trip and then give some faster. But yeah, I think that detective have died. I've been captured, who knows? stint in the nuthouse. I've packed you with armaments. I demand your complete cooperation. Our reconnaissance reports have confirmed Sebastian Marsh, the manager of the refinery, will be out of town on business. He's left his son Jacob in charge of operations. We won't get a better chance to launch this raid. Our mission is to capture Jacob Marsh. He may be our only chance to get under the skin of the Marsh family. We must secure him alive. Secure the entrance. Get in your positions, agents. Keep sight of the loading bay. On the roof. Sustain your fire. Take them down. Hold your fire. Cooper, get those damn doors open! Oh, machine gun. No, wait! Cooper! Take cover! Get clear of the car, Jack! Now!
down. The area is clear. There's nothing to target. It's locked. It's locked. Well done, Jack. Wait by me while my men secure the area. Get over here, Jack. Let my agents do their Check work. Check reception. It's locked, sir. Break it down, then secure the area. I want Marsh alive. Everything else is a viable target. Fall out. Understood, sir. Okay, Hoover. What's the plan? I want to know where the hell they're getting all this gold. Come on, let's take a look around. A mug, a pack of smokes, and a book. Reception must get real busy. I don't have time to check through all the files. <laughs> somewhere below. A game of cards was being played here recently. staring at Jack. He was just a field agent. He knew the risks. The power's been cut from the elevator. It must have been shut down from the mains. You try the next floor down. See if you can find the generator. I'll secure this floor. Ah, oh, man. The skin's been corroded from his body. He must have died in extreme pain. Nothing of interest. Ah, the gate's been padlocked. I can't open it. This hatch must provide maintenance access to the elevator shaft. It won't open. Hmm. This hatch must provide maintenance access to the elevator shaft. Hmm. This hatch must provide maintenance access to the elevator shaft. Nothing of interest here.
The doors bolted shut. choked up with boiling hot steam. The doors bolted shut. like a federal agent. The pipe must have cracked as he was moving past. Ah, the steam's too hot. I won't be able to make it to The doors bolted shut. Can't see anything of use. What is it? The elevator isn't responding. It needs to be powered back up. open. The elevator carriage must be blocking it. It won't budge. It won't open. Nope, nothing important here. Nope, nothing of interest. It's not important. Nothing of interest. Nothing of interest here. Can't see anything of use. Nope, nothing important here. The doors bolted shut. Nope, nothing of interest. Won't budge. It's not important. Eh, 
there's nothing important an empty hat stand. I'll leave the desk work to the FBI. Tempting, but I don't have time to check through all the files. It's a floor-mounted automatic rifle. The car has taken a severe battering. Driving away would book me a permanent stay in the asylum. After what happened to the last agent, I think I'll leave them sealed. There's nothing important here. Doors are tightly sealed. I won't be able to open them. Nothing of interest. Nothing of can't see anything of use. Nope, nothing important here. Nope, nothing of interest. It's not important. The doors bolted shut. The doors bolted shut. This hatch must provide maintenance access to the elevator shaft. <sighs> it won't open. The elevator carriage must be blocking it. 